I have some things to share today, and I think you'll like these. So let me just kind of walk you through a few things that, that we have changed on the platform that you may find it very interesting. When you click on the Elements tab now, and you click this, it's going to give you that little arrow. Can you see the arrow telling you exactly what you need to do? The cool thing is it's going to tell you how far to drag over. Sometimes people drag way over here and they have problems. So uh, just follow the instructions now. This is going to be really simple. Now there's some other really cool things. And I'm going to show you those right now as well. So let's say, for example, and I created a video on this earlier, but let's um, uh, I created a video and then this has changed since then. So let's do this. Let's go down to the bottom here. Let's say we want to add. Um, I want to add a new article at the end of this I want to add a new article so it's going to tell me to drag that article over here so I do now look at the the options that I have I can import using copy and paste when I do this it gives me the option of being able to copy and paste content right here second thing that I can do is if I'm going to do the same thing and now I can import from Word I can import from a URL I can import a draft click on my draft and this will pull up all of my drafts in my draft tab at the top of my uh, dashboard. So I've got a variety of drafts here. So let's do that. We'll our demo. And there it is right there. There's my air demo. So pretty cool features there be able to import inside of the the um, um, inside the platform now watch this this is another really cool feature uh, used to be that we could do this here uh, we could we could go to this we could make a local change here or we would have to go over here and make a global change now watch what happens I come over here to the global change and I can change the color of this background either for this element only or for all elements all paragraph elements or for just that paragraph element so I'm going to make it just that paragraph element. Now notice that when I do that, it doesn't change the paragraph elements up here. So I can make changes just based upon just that particular. Um, I, I can do all of that using these two tags right here. Select the element for just that one, or which we used to call local, or this one, which would be global. And so you can make those selections now for everything. I can do that with the uh, with the shadows. I can do it with padding. I can do it in each one of these, which is just an amazing feature. You guys did a really great job of being able to bring that up, and I can I can change the the uh, font style just for this paragraph only. Just simply select the the uh, the element that I want to make a difference in, and then I can decide whether I want to make that element or all elements just like that. 